Logan, I know you're looking ahead, obviously, to San Diego State. But how do you feel about the way that you played against New Mexico? What's your confidence level going into this one? Yeah, I uh, definitely felt good to have a game like that, um, especially, you know, you have those practices during the week that you feel like you're building the confidence, momentum with the guys, uh, getting familiar with throwing to some of these receivers and uh, getting a better connection with those guys. So to, to, to have a game like that and, you know, get crop uh, the catches that that guy's been waiting for and a touchdown, uh, it felt good. It felt good to be on the same page with everybody. And the O-line killed it once again. And, and that all props goes to those guys. It starts with them. And they gave me the time to make those throws and make some of the plays. And it felt good to have an overall good game as an offense. That touchdown to crop, I mean, you let loose. I mean, that was a 75 yard pass. Are you hoping uh, there's more of that in the playbook this week? Oh, oh, always. I think that's every, I think every quarterback wants to throw the ball downfield like that. But, uh, you know, that's another thing. I mean, we do it throughout the week, and uh, to, to have it translate into the game uh, felt good. Uh, we know we're capable of making those plays, and uh, maybe we have chunk plays here and there, but those big, those big touchdowns, that's, uh, we know that's in our offense and that we're fully capable of doing that. So it felt good to, to get that one. Were you surprised on your rushing touchdowns that uh, there were no defenders near you? It seemed like on either one of them. Yeah, I, we knew that those guys uh, played heavy into the run, and uh, I think it was just one of those field plays that, um, if you, like going through the last few weeks, there's a few balls I felt like I could have kept, and uh, getting those looks during the week, I felt those guys getting more and more aggressive and, and just uh, playing football, and there was nobody around, so that was nice. What did you think of uh, Bula representing uh, the team with a catch on the stat sheet? Yeah, that was funny. I was not expecting that. I was going to knock the ball down, and then I just felt his big body grab it, and then I got thrown out of the way, and everybody started cheering. That was pretty funny. I, that guy, I know he had a blast doing that. So this team's now won a couple games in a row. Um, how's everybody feeling? How's, how's practice been uh, now that you guys have a couple of wins under your belt in a row? Good, good. The confidence is building. Uh, there's good energy around the locker room, and uh, it's something that, that we expect. We expect to win, and we know we're, we're well capable of doing that. And so uh, just trying to continue to get better every day at practice in the, in the film room, weight room, and uh, everybody's on the same page, keeping each other up, and, and uh, the confidence is definitely building. The importance of the San Diego State game. I mean, obviously, it goes without saying that this is a must-win game for you guys. How are you approaching the week, and what have you seen from the Aztecs? Right. Uh, just another week. I mean, just another defense that, you know, they change up some looks. They have a similar defense to uh, New Mexico. So uh, obviously, uh, just another week of preparation. We know what these guys are all about. Um, they're good up front, and we got to be able to run the ball, and we got to let our guys make plays. And uh, we're going to have to be able to pass the ball as well. I think last year, Mims had a huge game, so uh, it all starts up front, and it's just another week of preparation. preparation. One more question for How much of a resource is Jake? I know you talked about Jake being a big part of your development as a quarterback, but how available is he for you like today during practice or during a game? What is he, yeah. how, does, how often does he talk to you? Uh, that guy's a huge help in all aspects. Even that's the first guy I talk to when I go to the sideline the last few games. Uh, so having him there helps a lot. Uh, the guy knows the ins and outs of football and schematics, and he's helped me come a long way as far as my mental my mental aspect of playing quarterback. So uh, having him near me all the time at practice and in the games has definitely helped, especially the last few weeks.